Today we're going to talk you through the best shoes for pain relief from Morton's Neuroma. Hi, I'm James from flawlessphysio.co.uk and jamesmccormack.com. I'm a knee, foot and ankle specialist. Today we're going to talk you through our recommendations for Morton's Neuroma pain relief based on our favourite shoes. After we review the shoes, we're going to give you some tips and mistakes to avoid if you're experiencing Morton's Neuroma. So the first shoe that we'd recommend is the Skechers Elite Max Cushioning. As you can probably guess from the name, one of the reasons that it's really helpful for your neuroma pain is the amount of cushioning that you'll find in the midsole and throughout the stack. This helps to absorb vibration and offload the neuroma. It has a relatively wide forefoot and a soft upper mesh. This helps to reduce compression on the Morton's neuroma and it provides extra comfort. So this is a shoe that we recommend if you've got mild symptoms of Morton's neuroma. For moderate symptoms of Morton's neuroma, we'd recommend the Hocker Clifton 9. This is Hocker's latest model of their neutral shoe. Similar to the Skechers Elite, it's got a really thick sole which helps to absorb cushioning. And the CM EVA sole of the Hocker is a lot lighter than that of the Skechers, which means that it's better for everyday use and it works well for running. One of the great benefits of Hocker is that they have an option of a normal size or an extra wide width. This helps to offload the neuroma as we know being able to spread your toes as you walk or as you move helps to reduce the discomfort on the neuroma and reduce the buildup of information within the web space. Finally, the Hocker has a low heel drop which means that the height from the back to the front of the shoe is about 4 millimeters, which means when you stand you have reduced pressure on the forefoot whereas if you have a high heel drop there's lots of pressure on the neuroma which can irritate your symptoms. Finally we'd recommend the Asics Gel Cumulus. This is Asics latest model of the Gel Cumulus and as you can see it's got their FF Blast cushioning which is a super light form of cushioning and it really feels like you're walking on a cloud. Although it has a slightly higher heel stack than that of the Hocker, we really like how light the shoe is and how cushioned it is. It has a really soft upper mesh which means that it wraps around your foot without compressing the toes together so reducing the chances of irritating your neuroma and it's a shoe that we'd recommend for moderate or severe symptoms. So all three shoes are really effective at reducing your pain levels. What can be helpful is wearing Morton's Neuroma insoles. We have a separate video on that that we'll put in the description. It's also helpful to consider doing exercises for your feet to help condition them and build up the muscle around your forefoot to help offload your neuroma. And stretching of the plantar fascia and the calf muscle can really make a big difference and we'll link an article to that in our description. All the shoes that we talked about today are linked in the description below. If you found the video helpful, please like and subscribe to get more similar content in the future or if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment box below.